Hello there and welcome to the card grotto. Today I've got the new Clearly Besotted stamps release to share with you. All of these items will be available in the shop tonight at 10pm Greenwich Mean Time. They will be available in the shop, the Clearly Besotted shop, also at Simon's Stamp and at elledhudson.com as well. And I will have links to all of those shops down in the description bar here on YouTube and also on my blog. So as I usually do, I'm going to go through all of the stamps and dies with you and share the samples that I've made using those um, sets as well, which are also on my blog in more detail. Um, I want to apologise for the lighting, although it is morning here, <laughs> 10 o'clock in the morning, it's really, really dark, so I've had to put my lights on and I, I do apologise, but um, this unfortunately is the best I can, I can manage at the moment. So first of all, one of the smaller sets, this is the baby shower set. Oh, it's so cute. I love this little elephant here. And you've got the little hearts that come out of the trunk or the little, um, like, splash marks. And all of these um, are the ears, so you can add those on top. So you could either stamp this as one layer and stamp the ear inside, or you can die cut and kind of add the ear on top, which is what I did. And there is a die set that coordinates as well that you can purchase separately. And then you've also got the, um, the baby sentiment, and you could add, like, baby girl, baby boy, new baby, or baby shower. Um, and a little exo there as well it's a really really cute little set and this is the card that I made using that set and um, what I did was I took um, a panel of cardstock cut out a square and um, added a little, little um, landscape there and then um, with the elephant itself I stamped it cut it out using the die and then I added the um, little ear on top um, and I did it kind of like with a little bit of um, dimension there um, I just thought that it's such a little cute image so I really like that and then the sentiment is from the a little sentimental set um, there is obviously this, the um, sentiments that you can use in this set but I wanted um, something quite plain and I thought it worked better with my design that I've used. So that's the um, baby shower set. And then next up is Child's Play, um, a really, really cute set, especially good for, um, again, new baby cards or little um, girls and boys cards, really, really cute. Um, you've got the little stackable um, kind of um, boxes or... Um, I'm trying to think what they're called, like blocks, that's the one, <laughs> blocks, um, you've got the little rocking horse, the little bear, um, the little um, doll girl, or a princess, and you've got the little train set, and you've got the little tiara and the crown that you can add on to the bear or the um, little princess doll, um, just really, really cute, and a little wand, and things like that, and then obviously you've got all of these beautiful sentiments, you've got birthday boy, welcome baby, birthday girl, little princess, big hugs, You've got an XOXO, um, just really, really cute. Um, unfortunately, I haven't had a chance to use this set for a sample to share with you, um, but I will be using it soon, and there is definitely samples for the from the other design team as well. Really, really cute. And there is a, um, a die set that you can purchase separately. Sorry, I haven't got it in any kind of packaging here, um, but there is a die set that coordinates. Next up is the, <coughs> excuse me, is the Flowers and Flourishes set really really cute set i love this set um you'll notice that the packaging has changed um stephanie has changed all the packaging this year um but there are some of the sets that were made sort of last year so you'll still see some of the old packaging um but there's there's no you know there's no difference or anything like that um so yeah so this is the flowers and flourishes set really really pretty i adore these little flourishes you could use them as leaves to go with the flowers or obviously you could use them separately you've got the like little buds here as well really really pretty i like that there's um outline images of the flowers and also solid ones and then you've got um happy happy birthday thanks and thank you so much um really good all round set and this is the card that I made using um, that set here. I made a little 4x4 kind of um, thank you note card that um, you could send out to people obviously and um, I just added a panel on top, the sentiment there and then I used one of the flourishes more as kind of leaves and then added one of the um, flowers on top and I just cut that out with some scissors. Very pretty. Next up is the Bon Voyage set, um, a really, really great set. Um, unfortunately, again, I haven't had a chance to make a sample with it, but I've, I had an idea that I would use it as in like a New Year card. I thought that would have been really, really good and kind of done the... Um, like a landscape and then in the sky have fireworks and things like that. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get time to make it, but... Um, you could use it obviously all year round as well. So you've got the um, <clears throat> you've got the Sydney skyline, you've got the New York skyline, and then you've got the London skyline as well. And um, just 
but I really like them and um, I love the kind of solid image of it and then you've got all these lovely sentiments as well you've got the um, the world is your oyster wish you were here London I heart um, Sydney wish big New York and Bon Voyage um, again I really like this set next up is the in print set um, it's such a good idea um, I know that um, Stephanie's daughter um, Jasmine uh, like helped with the idea of this set and kind of came up with it and it's just such a great idea really good for um, like children's cards in particular but as you could use them for adult cards as well and um, so the concept is that you have a fingerprint and then you kind of make your um, fingerprint into like an, little animals, which is really cute. So you've got the cat, the dog, little pig, a reindeer, a fish, um, a little bird, uh, a bee, a spider and a frog. Um, and then you've got all of these kind of little punny sentiments to go with them. So you've got um, hello dear, your tweet, treat yourself, make a splash, be mine, you're perfect. Um, happy birthday, oink, um, and boo, and just yeah, and the fingerprint obviously as well. Really, really cute. Um, and these are the cards that I made using that set. Um, I kept them really, really simple. Just made some little four bar cards. Um, I thought these, although I don't have children, I thought these would be really good for like um, little Valentine's um, cards for children. Um, so this one is the little cat, and you've got your perfect. But you could obviously use that as any kind of card all year round as well. And then there's a little B mine as well, and I used the little B for that one. Um, I really, yeah, it's such a cute set. <laughs> um, next up is the recipe for love. And again, another really, really great set, um, especially good for like friends who like cooking or you could use it um, like on tags and things like that or boxes that you're going to um, give a gift of like a handmade um like cake or whatever you know biscuits and things like that too um so you've got all of the little um cooking utensils a little rolling pin a whisk and a, a spoon um a kitchen age maker or any other um brands are available and um, a little whisk there um a little cupcake a biscuit tin another cupcake and you've got a little apron there and again lots of lovely sentiments to match you've got flour cookies baked with love sugar sweet treats recipe for love yummy and enjoy there at the bottom um really really cute again unfortunately i didn't get a chance to make a sample using that but i will be soon and there is a die set that coordinates again that you can purchase separately Next up is the With Sprinkle set. Again, another really, really great set, all round um, good set for lots of different occasions. And what's great is that you can build up the donuts or the cookies or whatever you know ones you're using so you've got kind of like the outline so you've got like the dough of the um the donut and then you've got the icing and then you've got the sprinkles that you can stamp on top and they do stamp really really quite easily on top of each other and then you've got some like heart cookies and star cookies and um just yeah really great kind of all around nice um nice set and you've got lovely sentiments to go with it you've got happy birthday and um, with sprinkles on top you've got cookies donuts nom um Donuts spelt in two ways because the English and the American are different. Um, you've got mmm <laughs> and you've got um, without you I'm empty inside so that's quite cute as well. And there is a die set that you can purchase separately for the cookies and the donuts. And this is the card that I made using that set. Um, I kept it really really simple. I stamped out the donuts and I, I like did them in the layers. I added a massive layer of glossy accents on the top um, just to give it some kind of icing effect. I cut out a little bite mark out of one of them and then I stamped the sentiment um, on the bottom there. Um, happy birthday with sprinkles on top. And then last but not least is a tiny small set, um, one of these smaller ones. Um, it's called a Chatem and it's really lovely <laughs> again all of them are of course but you know um so this is a really great set for kind of love themed cards valentine's um anniversary anything you want really and you've got the little eiffel tower there you've got the um champagne bottle and then you can also add the um like the label to it on top so you could use different colors which is really really great you've got um a flower um or a rose i should say with a stem and the rose top and then you've got the champagne glass and then you've got two different um kind of champagne fillings i suppose um that you can add into it um, and then you've got the jetem and the amour and then there is a die set that coordinates that you can purchase separately as well and um, be because i don't tend to make that many love themed cards i thought i would make a um, congratulations card with it 
and this could obviously be for a wedding or it could be for anything really um, so I stamped the um, champagne glasses and then added in the um, champagne inside and um, I used one of the sentiments from the Love Blossom set it just thought it was quite a nice small congratulations used a bit of glitter tape and added some sequins there and um, I just thought it made quite a nice um, little congratulations card so that was the um, release for January for 2015 I can't believe it we're already in 2015 um, and like I said I'll have links to where you can buy all the products tonight at 10pm and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon